In the next five minutes, I will teach you Pearly. So let's get into it. The deck revolves around the namesake card, Pearly. If you summon this little furball, you get to add a Pearly spell from the top three of your deck to your hand. Once per turn, you can reveal a Pearly spell in your hand to XZ on top of Pearly without needing a second material. Next, we have Pearlily. This one lets you add a Pearly spell from your entire deck to your hand, but it can't be a quick play spell. Pearlily lets you XZ summon using itself and a Pearly quick spell in the graveyard. Now you understand what the main deck monsters do, let's go over the XZs. You have three rank two Pearly XZs, Plump, Beauty, and Happiness. Each of these have an ability that can trigger thrice per turn when you play a Pearly quick spell, adding it as a material instead of sending it to the graveyard. When you do, they trigger a bonus effect. Plump banishes a monster until the end of turn. Beauty changes battle positions. Happiness returns spells or traps to the hand. Plump and Beauty have a unique effect as well that can become a quick effect if their associated memory is attached to them. Plump wants a delicious memory. Beauty wants a pretty memory. Plump's effect lets you add two pearly spells from the graveyard to it as a material. Beauty lets you target and negate one of your opponent's effect monsters. Happiness lets you add a pearly card from your deck to your hand, and if it has a happy memory, it can have the attack of a face-up monster. Finally, two pearly boss monsters, Noir and Happiness. Noir, a level seven X seed that you can summon using any rank two monster with five or more materials. If it has five or more materials, it is unaffected by your opponent's activated effects. For two materials, you can put a card your opponent controls or in the graveyard on the bottom of the deck. This effect can be a quick effect if you have a level one pearly monster attached to Noir as a material. Another level seven pearly you can go into is X pearly happiness. Similarly to Noir, you can summon it using any of your pearly with five materials. It lets you detach a card to negate the effects of all face-up monsters your opponent controls. If you have a level one pearly under this, your opponent can't respond to this activation. Whenever X pearly happiness attacks or is attacked, it deals 1500 damage to the opponent. So if you combine this with several happy memories and a way to make it indestructible, you can likely OTK your opponent on the spot. The spells and traps all have interesting effects. Pearly Eep lets you XZ summon a Pearly with a different rank so you can go from Noir into Plump, Beauty or Happiness, and vice versa. This is nice because some of the memory spells have once per turn effects that can be triggered again, as well as it giving you the opportunity to load up more materials onto a monster prior to going into something like a Zeus. So let's go over all the memories. First, I'll explain what they do when played, and after that, what they do as a material. Each, once you activate them, let you discard a card to summon a level one pearly straight from the deck. Delicious memory makes a monster indestructible in battle. Happy memory lets you choose a card and stops the first destruction effect until the end of the next turn. Pretty Memory has each player gain 1,000 life. Sleepy Memory stops the next damage you would take. As a material, Delicious Memory has the pearly gain 300 attack and defense times the number of materials attached to it. Happy Memory lets the pearly attack monsters up to the number of pearly happy memories attached to it, plus one. Pretty Memory lets you send a card you control to the graveyard and then target one of your opponent's cards and adds it as a material to your Pearly. Sleepy Memory lets you draw a card during the standby phase. Finally, we have My Friend Pearly and Stray Pearly Street as archetype support cards. My Friend Pearly lets you pay 500 life to reveal three Pearly cards from your deck and your opponent adds one to your hand at random. If one of your pearly XZs leave the field because of an opponent's effect or battle, you can add three different memories from your graveyard to your hand. Stray Pearly Street stops your opponent from targeting pearly monsters the turn they are special summoned. If one of your pearly XZs leave the field because of an opponent's effect or battle, 
you can special summon a level 1 Pearly from your deck or graveyard. Once per turn during the end phase, you can add a memory from your graveyard to your Pearly Exceed. And that pretty much covers Pearly as an archetype. A particularly cool combo is to use your Epperly Happiness's effect to continuously search happy memories from the deck and keep adding them to your Pearly, so you can attack four times in one combat phase. Combine that with Sleepy Memories' effect to have the attack of an opponent's monster, and making the opponent's monster indestructible with the delicious memory, and you create yourself a beat stick to keep swinging into until you win. Don't forget to subscribe and leave a comment and consider supporting me on Patreon or as a channel member. Making these guides is quite costly, and without the support of the community, I don't know how much longer I can continue making them. Anyway, thank you for watching and see you in the next video.